Hi, Tom and Ben. It's Grandma. Hi, how you guys been? We have another story for you, me and Carl. And this one is called, what is it called, Carl? It's called Splat the Cat. Back to school, Splat. Splat. Cat. That's pretty funny. <laughs> okay, here's the story. I like Splat the Cat, even though he's a cat and would probably eat me. <laughs> Not really. Splat's tail wiggled wildly with excitement as he walked to the cat school. It was the first day of school at a new school year, and he could not wait to see his old friends and his teacher, Mrs. Wimple Dimple. Oh, that's a funny, that's a funny uh, name for a teacher. Splat's tail dragged behind him as he walked home that afternoon. Now he was not excited at all. It was the end of the first day of school, the school year, and he already had homework. What's wrong, Splat? asked his little sister. I have to do a show and tell about my summer vacation, Splat said. That sounds fun, said his little sister. But I did so many super things. How can I choose just one to show, Splat said. Over the summer, Splat rode his bike in a very important race. Can I come too? asked Splat's sister. Little sister's bikes are not fast enough to race, Splat said. But she tagged along anyway, kind of like Ben and Tom. And he went swimming with sharks in the ocean. Whoa, hey, that looks like a cousin of mine. Can I come too? asked Splat's little sister. Little sisters aren't strong enough to fight off sharks, Splat, Splat said. But she tagged along anyway. Splat also played in a big soccer game. Can I come too? asked Splat's little sister. Little sisters aren't big enough to play soccer, Splat said. But she tagged along anyway. Splat! went searching for pirate treasure. Can I come too? asked Splat's little sister. Finding treasure is too hard for little sisters, Splat said. But she tagged along anyway. Splat even built a rocket ship to launch him into space. Guess what? Can I come too? asked Splat's little sister. Not now, Splat said. I'm counting ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Uh oh, I forgot what comes next. She tagged along anyway. Four, three, two, one, blast off, she said. I had lots of adventures, Splat told Seymour. How can I possibly choose just one to show? Seymour shrugged. He didn't have any ideas. Suddenly, Splat thought of something. There was one really important thing he could show. The next day, Splat went to school with his tail wiggling wildly. And Splat was most pleased that his sister tagged along too. Hey, he took his sister for show and tell. I like that. Well, I hope you enjoyed the story. Till next time. Bye. Bye-bye. Love you guys. Bye-bye.